This is what's called a fluorescent and fluorescent light. Yes, atoms and mercury vapor. Yeah. Now, I was kind of wondering about this yesterday, that it's a mercury vapor gives off ultraviolet rays when struck by electrons. Yes. Now, a lot of office buildings have what's known as fluorescent lighting. Yes, fluorescence is the visible light giving off by a phosphor. Mm -hmm. Invisible ultraviolet rays strike phosphor coating. Yes, this section highly magnified. Mm -hmm. Then there's the fluorescent lining of phosphor material. Yes, but it's the mercury vapor that gives off the ultraviolet rays. Mm -hmm. Could you uh, just look at the lighting? Mm -hmm. See, um, I myself am con concerned about the right kind of lighting. And a lot of presidential candidates, they have an office. And um, it's been my experience that sometimes if you use 5G through a fluorescent light, you could inundate the individual with mercury. <clears throat> now, we know about the mercury fillings. Yes. And there's been some talk that if you used uh, some sort of 5G in the mouths of those that have mercury fillings, it will emit a mercury gas in the individual's mouth, <coughs> causing them a certain amount of sickness. Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. Now, when you think about the use of technology in fluorescent lighting, there are the fluorescent lights that replace the candescent light bulb. Yes. But then there are the fluorescent lights that are used in homes, factories, schools, and office buildings, uh -huh. and even for highway, highways and streets. Yes. Now, somebody's been doing a... Are you standing in the light today? Why don't you get me the actual office of every president in every nation? All the vice presidents, Pence, Pooch. And then all presidential candidates and the possibility of their vice president Oach being with them. <laughs> now, when you talk about the use of technology, you could send the 5G through a fluorescent. 